How much is tomato in your area? Everybody is planting tomato at home now. So here is my own tomato. I did a video on this tomato. You can check with the link in my description. So today I'm going to show you how to harvest this tomato and prepare it before you make your stew or any other thing. So this is where you cut it. There. Just right there. You cut it. And... I plucked three that were ripe and this is how it looks like very beautiful but it's usually soft that's my experience with it let's head straight to preparing this so I have already washed the three tomatoes yeah this species of tomato is called the snake guard uh, I don't know why they gave you snake guard maybe because it's long anyway so after washing it make sure you wash it clean to rid of dirt and germs from it you're going to get a bowl and a filter you put the filter on top of the bowl and just follow the process you can see me doing on screen so you're going to um, open this tomato it's very easy because it's kind of soft like if you're not even careful you can <laughs> um bust it open why plucking it so that thing i removed is like the head of the tomato and just discard it because those thread like things are strong and you wouldn't want to destroy your blender with that thread like things and um you would not even like it in your food so the yellowish part that's the outer part of it you put it under the bowl like i'm doing while inside of the tomato where you have the seed okay the other part of the head just toss it away Why inside this red part that's the seed you'd um, put it into the filter because you have to remove the seed from the flesh and you understand what i'm saying when you just watch exactly what i'm doing so like i said discard the threadish parts which is like the head of the tomato that part open up the tomato bring out the seed and the other end of the tomato, the other head or the bottom of the tomato, also trash that one. Just like you're seeing on video, bring out all the seeds and the back of the tomato, put it under that in the bowl. So, yeah, just watch what I'm doing. In the comment section please tell me how much you buy tomato in my area and it's usually the farmers market i go to about five seeds of tomatoes go for sorry not five six seeds for 500 naira and they are really tiny so i had to plant this my mom told me it's a special of tomato and it's really nice it's thick it's like thin tomato and here is me trying it and in case you haven't tried it watch this video and tell me if you're going to try it so we're done with removing all the skin or the back of the tomato and we head straight now into preparing the seed part so this seed part all you're going to do is just to press the flesh of the the flesh covering the seed and then remove the seed so you can either do it one 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 which will be slow or yeah that's the seed can you see that it's huge and very strong that's why we are not blending it together with the tomato you have to remove the seeds not to destroy your blender so after that just use your hand and squeeze just like you do for bitter leaf if you're washing bitter leaf the same process that's what you do to remove the seeds the flesh away to separate the flesh away from the seed so you do that and then take the seeds out of the flesh because that flesh is going to also go into the bowl for blending that's the seed very strong <laughs> so we are done and this is the skin covering the seeds it is very essential you blend that with the skin of the tomato because i guess that is what gives it its color because the back of the tomato itself is yellow but that's inside the flesh 
covering the seed is reddish let's go straight now to blending this yeah that's the seed like i've shown you before and let's head straight to our blender so i've put the tomato into the blender this is it without adding any water as you blend you may need to add water if your blender can carry the thickness of the paste and we are done this is our snake god tomato very beautiful it looks like a jam or like um tomato paste the tin tomato very beautiful and now your tomato is ready you can use it to prepare your stew just as you prepare before no special procedure or for jollof rice or whatever you want to use it for it's ready thank you for watching and if you're new kindly subscribe